Hey guys, Machines and Mala here. Beautiful December day. I think it's the 4th today. And I haven't made a video in a long time. It's been really, really quiet on the YouTube channel. So I thought I'd just do a quick update of where we are on this trailer build. I haven't forgotten about it. We went and parked it over at another farm for a little while because we had some other things to take care of at the, at the barn, at the shop. And uh, I, since last video, um, I don't know if I remember, I showed you I had these rims, these galvanized trailer rims, they're 15 inch, um, five bolt, I can't remember what the bolt pattern is, but standard trailer bolt pattern, 110 or 114 or something like that. Anyway, I went online and I bought a pair of these um, Carlisle, Carlisle Sport Trail LH. Um, these are 205 75-15s, and they're actually a bias ply tire, guys. So uh, bias ply tires on a trailer such as this, I feel are good because they handle um, the, the weight in the sidewall better than radial tires. Um, there's a big discussion online about what's better, bias ply or radial ply. I've always had radial style tires on trailers, and I figured, you know what, I'm going to give bias ply a try. So here they are, got uh, a pair of these mounted up. Just installed the first one. That's the old wheel that was on the trailer when we got it. I think that's probably about 40 years old. And there's a brand new tire on a rim. So I'm here with my handy dandy DeWalt impact gun. Just changing these wheels over. Gonna do this guy here next. And uh, I also picked up a pair of uh, fenders for this from a local trailer supply shop. And I'm just gonna be picking up a set of uh, tow uh, toe grade, toe quality um, magnetic brake lights. Someone locally is selling them on a on a local buy and sell website, and they're an extremely heavy duty uh, set of lights meant to go on the back of a vehicle. When you tow it, you stick them on the trunk behind your tow truck. I'm going to adapt them and install them on this trailer permanently. I think they should be heavy duty enough to last. And uh, yeah, so that's what, what I've worked on today. And this, like I said, beautiful December fourth. Day, I think it is out here and uh, yeah I haven't forgotten about the channel I'm gonna make some more videos when when I start working on some stuff um, got some new things coming up like oh what's this guys look what we picked up today this is a Yamaha Yamaha golf cart got this guy um, from the scrap yard saved it out of the scrap pile and uh, someone's gone and removed all the electronics, the electrical batteries are gone, the motor's gone, but they did leave a very useful rolling chassis. The brakes work, the steering works, the suspension works, the tires are good guys, and I feel that this needs a transplant. I think we're going to do something silly, something, something gas powered, something that'll require us to beef up the suspension so this thing can do some drifts, etc. Stay tuned for that. I'll make another video about the uh, the Yamaha golf car project. I haven't thought of a name for it yet. We're definitely going to need this trailer to tow it around when it's done. So we will finish this off. We got a nice box for the front. We're going to build some sides and uh, come up with a ramp. Anyway, yeah. So I haven't forgotten about you. Um, stay tuned. I'll make some more videos coming up, and when uh, when the winter's over, I'll probably really start pumping them out for you to see. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a great uh, holiday season coming up if I don't make too, more, too many more videos before the end of the year. And uh, have a good one. Hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching.